Hello everyone. Uh, today let's talk about sequential construction in robot structure analysis. Suppose we have a structure like this. So the, the purpose of the sequential uh, construction analysis is to uh, perform an analysis that uh, is closer to the real structure uh, when we do the construction. So for example, if we have a, a structure like this, the transfer beam should uh, be the, the component that resists all the load from the above uh, floor. But if you do the, uh, the normal analysis, the structure will uh, consider this like a, a, truck, uh, a truss structure. So it uh, works together uh, to resist the load. But uh, in real life, it doesn't, uh, in, in a real construction, it doesn't work like that. So we need to uh, do a sequential construction. Uh, you can call it a, a construction stage analysis. So first I'm going to uh, show you the normal analysis. So I have a save back here. I'm going to run the analysis. Now we can turn on the deformation. And I turn on the, the value. Sorry, uh, I'm going to check the load here. Okay, so now this is the deformation of uh, the, the whole structure. So you can check the deformation of the transfer beam. This is a 20 millimeter. You can uh, not uh, remember this number. We're going to compare with the uh, sequential construction. Now to do the construction stage analysis, we need to, uh, sorry, we need to add another load type. So let's call this sequential. So next I'm going to load table and create another load case. And this is the save weight. I'm going to choose all the member and change this one to sequential. So now you can run the anal analysis again. Okay, so now the analysis is complete. And to have a better view, I'm going to show only the, uh, the first frame here. So this is the survey. So as you can see, it is the 20 millimeter. So this is how the uh, the structure deform. As you can see here, uh, these uh, uh, members are working together to resist all the load. So it's a uh, it's like a truss structure. But uh, this is the sequential uh, analyze uh, construction analysis. So as you can see, this is the transfer beam that works to uh, resist the above load. 
so this is more realistic as you can see uh, the deformation here it's uh, uh, quite bigger than the normal analysis here so this is how you can uh, do the sequential construction analysis and global structural analysis to uh, uh, perform a real construction in the robot structural analysis so i hope you get the idea and i see you guys in the next video thank you